Okay, uh, let's see. This is an uh, Asteroids. I got it in the garage here, and I turned the lights are off so you can kind of see the screen. What's good. So this is a, isn't a, a vector. The trailing and stuff isn't on the actual screen. It's a lot clearer. Um, but what's unique about this particular game is this is a multi-vector machine, multi-asteroids. The guy just developed it, and it has multiple vector games on it. So it's called, uh, I think you call it Masteroids Board. So um, anyway, so you got your original... You got your original asteroids, which if I just push this, you know, you can, I can go and play. Okay. All right. So, so we got asteroids, the original, which is the game that's on this cabinet is. If we click it again, we got, this is asteroids deluxe. We hit the one and two player buttons. This is a lunar lander. And then if we click again, this is battle zone. Switch which works. <laughs> here called red baron it's a little bit harder to control but it does work okay and then, and this is um cinematronics game I forgot it's like a helicopter i don't know how to some of this is still being completed but it has a bunch of vector games on it okay and then i'm going to just go ahead and reboot this so if I open the coin door, so you need a light for the, so once you turn the power off and on, it'll go back to asteroids. You can have it save um, what game you were at or whatever. It just needs an SD card in the game board that's in the back, but it's all original, all original wiring, everything is in here. So it's just a matter of, you know, if you want to put an original asteroids board in here, you can, but um, this is, this is, this works really well.